All right, Chuck. Here's a quick video on how to program something into memory on the FT3, excuse me, the FTM300. Um, I just happen to have the same radio, which is cool. So you have your A and B band, and you also have your memory or VFO mode. So once you're in VFO mode and on a frequency that you want, um, that you program in using your mic. So instance, this one, I just take my mic and I go four, four, three, zero, zero. And because my radio is already set up to recognize that as a repeater frequency, it's already put the shift in there. To do your tones, you go up to your function button and use your top knob to select function, push enter on the knob, set your transmitting power, your squelch type, in this case, tone. Scroll down here to tone, press enter. You can adjust your tone, press enter to accept. Squelch type and transmit power the same way. This is your enter button here. And then you keep pressing until you get the desire same with squelch. Once you're finished with that, you hit the back button and the back button again. And now you have your frequency, your offset, your tone, and your transmission type of FM. If you want to change your transmission type, you press the DX button once, press it again, press it again, until you're to the desired mode. In this case, just strictly FM. Once you're ready to set this into memory, you take your VM button here, press and hold, and now you have a memory list or channel list. Select an available one, which is indicated by all these dots and blanks here. Press your enter button. It'll ask you to write it to that. So now that is written to my memory channel number five. If I switch back to memory, now memory channel five is this with the set tone and FM. And if I key up, you can see that it shifts and it took the shift. Now, if you want to name this, it's the same function. Press and hold your memory button, scroll up to your memory channel, enter, and now you can edit and go down to tag and then use the dial to name your channel. So this particular one, we'll go to caps. And then to N numbers seven Back to the alphabet, and then we'll put in L, G, N. Now that I've got everything selected, I'm going to press and hold the enter button, and now it's tagged. If I go back down to OK, and again, using that knob as your enter button, push N, hit OK, Hit OK again, and now it's labeled, as you can see here, with N7LGN. Now if I go back, now I have my tag and my frequency. Rinse and repeat for any other frequencies that you want to put in. And you can use the mic for direct input, or if you'd like, when you're in the VFO mode, you can hit the function button go up to here and say enter frequency and then scroll through and enter your frequency. Hopefully that helps and get you down the road of saving frequencies. I cheated and actually got the little SD card that goes into the side of this little guy and I did a memory dump and then I used the software off of Yesu's site to basically program the memory card and then I told the radio to read all my channels. A little bit faster way of doing it, but a little bit more complicated if you're not familiar with the computer or how to program them. But nonetheless, hopefully that helps.
This is David in 7MKY, video for just you.